This is truly a special day. This time last year, we knew nothing about COVID-19. It wasn't until December 31st that we heard of a viral pneumonia, distant reports of a viral pneumonia. We've come so far in such a short amount of time. Um, I know that's a big fear, but for me personally, I just saw, you know, the biggest amount of teamwork that there could possibly be. Finding this vaccine, being able to offer it to people in such a quick amount of time is, is amazing. All of the training, all of the preparedness in the world does not eliminate the body's recognition of danger. And despite that danger, despite the PPE shortages, despite the personal hardships that our first responders have experienced all year, they continue to choose fight over flight. The COVID-19 vaccine is key to our community's fight against this disease. Being on the front lines and getting that vaccination and that is something that gives me the most hope, you know, as we uh, put a cap to 2020 and move in to 2021 and it's that our people who are on the ground every single minute serving this community are getting what they rightfully deserve. Many of our members in some of the community are kind of hesitant about the vaccine. They're concerned about the side effects and, and, and they're uncertain. So we just want to show uh, as a group our confidence in the vaccine and how important it is for us to get vaccinated, for the first responders to be vaccinated and also for the general public to get the vaccine as it becomes available. Number one, while we're here to get this vaccination, you cannot drop your guard. You still should adhere to all of the precautions that have been set out. It's going to take a while for the vaccine to protect you. This is an emotional moment, I think, for not only our community, but our nation. And as you said, Mayor, it could not have been at a better time. So I appreciate you coming here to be with us today to pay honor um, and happy holidays to us all.